Now we turn to a conspiracy theory that's become a deadly weapon in Russia's war on Ukraine. The Kremlin claims without any evidence that the U.S. has helped Ukraine develop biological weapons in secret laboratories. Chris Livesay got exclusive access to a Ukrainian lab at the heart of this information war to check out the bogus claims that some Americans, including members of Congress, actually believe. It's here, Russia says, where Ukraine and the United States are developing biological weapons, a secret lab that in this leafy neighborhood isn't so sinister after all. That's Rambo, the only security at Kyiv's public reference laboratory. We're the first journalists allowed inside since Russia's invasion, but it's routinely inspected by international agencies like the WHO. Natalia Videko, chief of research, shows us equipment for containing some of the most infectious diseases known to humankind. Cholera, anthrax, everything. Everything. Not to make weapons, she tells us, but to test for diseases in patients. I see. So you use it to identify yeah. the pathogen yeah. in other people, correct? Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. But that all changed once the Russian army invaded Ukraine. So there's been active shelling yeah. in this area. Yeah. Since the war, you've destroyed all of the strains. Yes, because it was very high uh, biological risk. If this building was attacked, that could have been dangerous if no. those strains had gotten loose. If, if uh, they will be this, yes, it's, it's possible. So you put the pathogens in here. Yes, it is a special program. Uh, and it destroys assistant. them. Yes, it makes them course. so that they can't hurt anybody. Yes, of course. By we order of the government, she says, all particularly dangerous strains in Ukrainian labs were killed. Of course, you're familiar with the accusations from Russia that this laboratory and others like it have been developing uh, biological weapons. This crazy fake, uh, non-fact, non-history, not evidence, just blah, blah, blah. But the viral conspiracy theory lives on. The Kremlin even insists it's one reason Russia invaded Ukraine to begin with. Putin President Putin has said on numerous occasions that the threat has come right to our border, said Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov. Military laboratories creating pathogens. Moscow's baseless claim has been amplified online and on TV. What exactly are they doing in these secret Ukrainian bio labs? You don't know what they're working on over there. See, the U.S. be doing some stuff. A poll found 26% of Americans believe it, including members of Congress. That. Well, come to find out, in fact, it's true. Instead, what's really killing people is Russia's war, fought not just with bullets and bombs, but with disinformation and deceit. Are you afraid that the Russian military could target this it's building? It's possible. It's possible. Uh, when we first heard these lies about bioweapons, we thought it was funny, she says, but we're not laughing anymore. For CBS Mornings, Chris Livesay, Kyiv.